Hello everyone and welcome to Foreman. When you hear the term freedom, what is the first thing that comes to your mind? Freedom of speech, freedom of choice, freedom of expression, etc, etc, etc. And freedom is such a thing which must be accessible to each and every one of us. But in India, this is not the case because freedom is something which is only meant for one gender that is female. Today we are having with us a prominent men's rights activist, Nandini Bhattacharji, who is the president of All Bengal Men's Forum and she has also received various awards for her work. So let us see what she has to say about freedom. Hello Mrs. Nandini Bhattacharji, welcome to Foreman and thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much Antara. I'm very very happy because first of all today uh, I'm getting a chance to be introduced with the Gohati people rather not these people because earlier I was not introduced to them at all and very happy for that. Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity. Thank you. Yes, we are honored to have you, ma'am. Uh, so uh, now, uh, firstly, the first topic that uh, that I would like to uh, you know uh, discuss today or I would like to rather ask the question to you is that uh, okay. a few years back, there was an advertisement released and that advertisement was actually endorsed by a celebrity, a popular uh, personality. And it mainly uh, focused on these words that it's her choice. I hope this ad uh, has been witnessed by many people. Many people knows about this ad. Yeah. And I'm not naming the celebrity yeah. right now. But this uh, advertisement mainly spoke about the choices that a female or a woman can make. She can make any choice um, uh, as as she wants to. She can, uh, you know, uh, prefer, you know, have to have an extramarital affair, or she can prefer to have yeah. anything she wants to, and nobody can actually stop her. But when we talk about men, uh, then these choices or freedom is not applicable to men actually. So you are a woman. I'm a woman. So I will ask this question to you that. Uh, what is your point of view on this? That is it actually fair that a woman should have all kinds of choices but not a man? See, you have uh, on the first question only, you have pointed out the very, very important question because not in that advertisement only, everywhere uh, in India, because India is a basically it's a pro feminist country, we are trying to. Uh, propagand and the thing, uh, my body, my choice, women are telling, okay. But nowhere we are uh, seeing this kind of advertisement for men because you see, if a man will be doing such things, then we will tell this man is characterless, he is going up here and there. I don't want to utter the places, but, but these things we have and give to the woman this power and we call it woman empowerment. But this is not true. This is not woman empowerment. Whenever we are talking of woman, now, but woman will tell this is a patriarchal society. This is a patriarchal society. But what is a patriarchal society? Patriarchal society is a concept that's no way related to men. Women are also very much patriarchal when the question coming of a um, mother-in-law, somewhere she's also some sometimes somewhere she's also torturing her daughter-in-law. She's beautiful. Sometimes you will see a video, a mother, she is beating a son or daughter, like two years, three years, like anything. That's also the same thing. Patriarchy means the sense of possession. It can be for a woman, for a man, for a child, everybody for a senior citizen. But in India, whenever the feminist, uh, the quote unquote feminist, whenever they are talking about anything, rather some men also, whenever they are talking about something and regarding women, they are talking, they are starting their uh, sentence or their debate or their talk show with patriot. But in India, always um, woman is telling my body, my choice, my life, my choice. But nowhere, Nowhere a man can tell this. My body, my choice. My life, my choice. Because if you tell this, then not you, rather, if a 
man will say this or utter this word, then there will be a different question, then there will be a different situation. So it's a very different world in whole world, as the picture is saying, not in India only. So the picture is very different, what we see, what we think. We are always thinking women are very tortured, women are I don't I don't think he, any anybody will say this the women are not tortured. Yeah, they are tortured. Somewhere, sometime they are definitely tortured. But those women, what is PS, what is law, what is 498A or what is the DB? They are tortured and they are tortured. And they are like that only. They don't know anything about all this. But in urban society and semi-urban also, I'll tell you semi-urban. The women are misusing it like anything, and so everything is in mess. And that's not a woman empowerment. Definitely, that's not woman empowerment. Yes, because when we talk about empowerment, then you know uh, nothing can be biased. If we talk about equality, nothing can be biased. It, it has to be fair. But uh, what yeah. we see, uh, we are seeing in the current scenario is that. Uh, uh, biasness is you no. Know, uh, there is always a biasness, and the judgments are always favored or bent towards that one gender, that is the female gender. Mm -hmm. So uh, now, if I talk about judgments, generally we have seen, uh, we have uh, till date seen a lot of judgments where the judges have ordered uh, the husband to pay ma uh, maintenance to the wife, whereas they also mentioned one thing that adultery cannot be a ground to deny maintenance, but Marriage, the concept itself has been made uh, so that people can be committed to each other and they can stay together forever. And that's the reason that there is a legal procedure, you know, uh, to uh, get married also and to get divorced also. But when adultery comes, why is it so that uh, adultery cannot be a basis on which a man or husband can deny maintenance because it has been a breach of trust? So what do you have to say about this? No, there is uh, another thing. Uh, the judgment was not only that, it was also like this. In, in case of adultery of wife, it's, uh, you can take it lightly. Yes, yes. It's not so, um, what can I tell you? I don't know what should I say regarding this. Uh, but in, if it is with the husband, then it will be um, something very, very serious. It will be of domestic violence. It will be of 498 day, and it will be then it will be going to 125 CRPC or something. But as we deal with this type of cases in our forum, um, many men are coming to us in one flat. Okay, that man has tried a flat, what a flat, uh, and he is giving the EMI. But in that flat, he is not staying. His wife is staying with his boyfriend in that flat. But the EMI is given by the man. Okay. So problems are everywhere. And this, this type of judgment, what can I tell you? This type of judgment is cause of many, many problems in the society. Suicidal rate is very high for men. Yeah. This, this, this kind of things are one cause of that. Because many Men are coming here, they are they are really, really they are jobless. They have no money, they have nothing after this COVID situation. But court has ordered, you have no money, you have no job, doesn't matter. You have to give the maintenance to your wife. Now, can you tell me from where they will give it? Now, yes, that's sometime what. court is telling. Yeah, now sometime court is telling you have to give it to sell your flat, you do this, you do that. And after this situation, this man is under utter depression. Mm. Utter depression, his family is utter depression. And after that, he is going for suicide. Now we have to think, this is not the way. And when your wife is going for adultery and you are from law point of view, you are telling this is not something very serious. And you can give him maintenance and you can maintain him for I think these problems are very serious. We have to think about all this. This is not very yes. easy. 
Yes, and also in one of the judgments, I have seen that they say that a wife's abortion report cannot be used, you know, to prove her adultery. Also, I did not understand at all that actually nobody understand uh, understood by reading the judgment that how the abortion report uh, reports cannot be a proof of adultery. You know, because they are no, saying that it's it's private. No, we discuss. We have also this case that the girl is the mother of the child. We have also come that he also tells that ma'am, we do not know this. She was pregnant and she got abort. She got a yes. We don't yes, know anything yes. about this. I think this is also a crime. very different uh, and i'm telling you one thing but if if there is a case like this he, the husband and his uh, family um, they have tried to abort the child for his wife aap samajh rahe na main kya bol rahi hu husband aur uske family they have tried to abort the child okay that will be a very big offense yes वो बहुत बड़ा अपराध है दैट विल बी अ क्रिमिनल ऑफेंस आई शुड से क्रिमिनल ऑफेंस देन आई थिंक यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड लेकिन बट व्हेन द गर्ल इज डूइंग द सेम थिंग किसी को नॉलेज में भी नहीं है कि वो अबोर्ट करके आ गई तो वो ऑफेंस नहीं है उसका जो रिपोर्ट है दे आर नॉट कंसीडरिंग इट्स अ क्रिमिनल ऑफेंस देन अगेन दैट माय बॉडी माय चॉइस यस बट हाउ कैन इट बी माय बॉडी माय चॉइस व्हेन यू आर किलिंग अ चाइल्ड रदर आई डोंट थिंक इट्स अ चाइल्ड व्हेन यू आर किलिंग अ लाइफ How can it be my body, my choice? It cannot be. Ma. Yes, and uh, also we have seen uh, that in many cases, what happens is that a uh, woman can easily file a case. She can easily make a complaint against anyone she wants to, and that too without evidence. And her case is also being registered so easily, and uh, without mm-hmm. evidence, the police can also come and you know har- harass the boy. Um, I mean, the husband and his family, and they can also arrest. Even though now the rate of arrest has been reduced, but still, uh, without yes, evidence, you have to proper proof of everything. Otherwise, arrest is yes. not there. Yes. Yes. So a woman, you know, the court gives ample amount of time to the woman to collect evidences. But yeah. if the boy or husband is innocent and he has proofs to show that he is actually innocent and uh, the one who is at fault is his wife. St- still then uh, the court doesn't believes in or he his mouth is totally shut by the court shut down yeah. by the court and he is not even given a chance to speak about his side of the story and the court will always listen to the girls or the women's side of the story yeah. so this, what do you think about yeah, yeah. this thing see for this uh, this things only we are asking for at least a 498 b we are asking for men's commission at least men can go and, and right. men can Uh, talk there men can um, ask for uh, justice because in, you see in ncrb data in india there is no amount of uh, what can i tell you kuch milta nahi hai kyunki yahan pe domestic violence in india not in india also in whole world domestic violence means it's with women yes nobody yeah. thinks domestic violence can be with men also but if there is a men's commission then men can go there yes. and they can talk to the officers and everybody and they can write down their complaints and at least end of the year ncrb can get a data of how many men are coming how many complaints are there you don't know you never know uh, end of the year ye complaint uh, women's commission ke complaints se zyada ho bhi sakte we don't know na Otherwise, we want a 498B at least. जहाँ पे वो लड़का जो है वो और उनके घर वाले जो है वो भी जाके कम्प्लेन कर सके अदरवाइज देर इज नो वे नाइंग एवरीवेयर लोकल पी एस और एवरीवेयर दे आर नॉट इंटरटेन बिकॉज देर इज नथिंग नो लॉ इज देर नथिंग इज देर बिल्कुल Can the lawyers and police actually play you know, in reducing the false cases? 
because i think they are the one who are mainly involved so what role do you think they can play in reducing the cases they play the major role now when see those who are in police they are very efficient person and they are very experienced also whenever someone is coming to them they actually know who is lying who is false and who is true yes yes they are very experienced because mm-hmm. we are doing the work from 2007 2017 whenever anybody is coming to our office now we can uh, tell you who is false or who is true sometimes so these things also happen na ki koi koi hamari yahan pe bhi aa jate hai the two or those who are not tortured that much men okay hamari yahan pe aa jate hai forum pe ek try karne ke liye ki jaake dekhte hai to kya hota hai but actually that man is torturing his wife okay lekin hum logo ko pata chal jata hai shuru mein because we are working with this from 2017 and now we know from body language from posture from how they are talking and everything and we ask them for proof and everything hum log ko pata chal jata hai and now you see in police they are very experienced and efficient also so un logo ko bhi pata hota hai jo bhi aate hai na wo each one is false and which one is true so from that time they can do the exact role some sometimes they are doing some pieces are doing but most of them are not doing that's the what can i tell koi bahut dukh ki baat hai and lawyers mm. another lawyers doing another thing whenever any anybody is coming to them any men or their family what lawyers are doing they demotivating them are ye ho gaya ab to kabhi arrest ho jayenge aap warrant abhi nikal aayega oh what you are doing here yeah. sabse kharab baat jo hai they are telling are प्लीज आप लोग भाग जाओ जाके पुलिस स्टेशन में मिलो मत बट वी आर ऑलवेज टेलिंग एवरीबॉडी कि प्लीज गो एंड टॉक व्हेनेवर यू आर टॉकिंग देन दे विल थिंक ओ नो ही इज राइट ये लोग फिर ठीक है ये लोग कुछ किया नहीं है बट दे आर टेलिंग अरे आप लोग भाग जाइए एकदम मत जाइए ठीक है अरे यू आप लोग अरेस्ट हो जाएंगे वारंट निकल जाएगा दिस थिंग्स आर नॉट गुड यू आर टेकिंग मनी एंड यू आर द पर्सन हु विल पहले सबसे भरोसा देना चाहिए नहीं कोई बात नहीं इसमें कोई प्रॉब्लम है नहीं हम लोग संभाल लेंगे सब लोग तो इसलिए ना हमारे फोरम में हमारा ना पूरा लीगल नेटवर्क है trying to spread spread it throughout india hum log na pehle unse baat kar lete hain ki dekhiye sir hamare yahan se jo log jayenge na pehle aisa mat kijiye please ye bhi arrest ho jayega abhi warrant nikal aayega aisa mat kijiyega kyunki wo log pehle se hi na yahan pe jab aate hain na they are very much broken wo log pehle se na bahut ghabraye hue hain because they are thinking ki everything is bold from the blue दीदी हमारे घर में तो कभी ऐसा हुआ नहीं है yeah. मैं उन्हें बताऊं कि ये सब किसके घर में होता है दिस इज एन एक्सीडेंट एक्सीडेंट तो रोज रोज नहीं होते हैं तो वी टोल्ड ऑल ओवर लॉयर्स लाइक दिस कि आप लोग ना पहले थोड़ा सा भरोसा दीजिए उनको एंड प्लीज डोंट ट्राई टू मेक आउट ऑफ मनी फ्रॉम एवरीथिंग दिस इज अ ट्रू फैक्ट या क्योंकि जो लॉयर्स और पुलिस जो है हाँ जो लॉयर्स और पुलिस जो है उनका मेन एम यही होता है कि हम पैसे कैसे लें इनसे दे आर नॉट ट्राइंग टू यू नो हेल्प देम दे उल्टा दे आर एक्सटॉर्टिंग बट आई हैव टू से वन थिंग आई एम वर्किंग फ्रॉम टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटीन अदर आवर फोरम वी ऑल्सो है मेनी लॉयर्स बट देर आर ऑल्सो समबडी समथिंग सम पी एस एस सम लॉयर्स दो आर डूइंग नॉट द राइट बट वी हैव गॉट इमेंस हेल्प फ्रॉम दे बिकॉज यहाँ सब तरह के लोग होते हैं ना दिस because everybody is there so but they have they are, they should play a very 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 important role that is they can play a very very important role in this thing yes definitely and according to you since this all about now this is about men's rights only so what uh, according to you uh, like you feel that you know the men and the men's rights activist or such organizations should actually do or they must do to raise more awareness about such issues because uh, till date i have seen there are many people men actually who do not know that such cases actually happens 
even i personally spoken to many uh, men and they are not aware of such cases so what uh, should uh, what do you think that uh, uh, the men and the men's rights activists and such organizations should actually do now uh, to you know spread more awareness about such issues yeah, yeah. only thing is you have to uh, every every day each and every day you have to uh, publicize this thing you have to talk about this thing in social media because nowadays social media is a very very big thing uh, every time and every day you have to speak about these things that the thing you are telling awareness we have to create that we have to sensitize everybody and according to this is according to me i think जैसे फेमिनिज्म के बारे में सब बात करते हैं ना तो एवरीबॉडी हैव टू टॉक अबाउट दिस मेंस राइट एवरीबॉडी बिकॉज़ सम विक्टिम्स आर टॉकिंग अबाउट इट सम एमआरएस आर टॉकिंग अबाउट इट नो इट विल नॉट वर्क एवरीबॉडी हैव टू टॉक अबाउट इट राइट राइट फ्रॉम द रिक्शा बुलर देन फ्रॉम द प्रोफेसर एवरीबॉडी शुड ऑल एडवर्टाइजमेंट शुड बी लाइक दिस एवरीवेयर इफ एनी शो एनी टॉक शो एनी डिबेट एवरीवेयर we have to talk about this in every social media and everywhere men's right men's right men's right like feminism jaise feminism ka hua hai na wo baat karte karte baat karte karte jaise jaise matlab we have to think those those who are working with this men's right we have to think it's a way of life it's not ki aisa nahi ki main ja ke thoda baith gaya ek baar do char jhanda utha liya और कहीं पे जाके दो चार गर्मा गर्म बात बोल ली कोई टीवी चैनल में जाके और कहीं पे भी एक इंटरव्यू दे दिया नो नो दिस नॉट लाइक लोगों ये सोचना पड़ेगा कि we have to think up 24 hours about this कैसे ये होता है and we have I think another thing is very very important कि woman को क्या मिला है वो लोग क्या कर रही है वो ऐसा किया वो ऐसा क्या है that's not our first perspective we have to think what we need to do for men or men's welfare उनके पास क्या है नहीं उनके लिए क्या चाहिए अभी क्या करना पड़ेगा अभी तक क्या है नहीं and that's men's welfare we have to talk about that and what's main success story not only problem 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 unka success story kya hai abhi kya ho raha hai main means ke upar sare duniya mein kya kaam chal raha hai what is this like this kind of thing we have to talk about all these things every time then only it will grow otherwise not yes i definitely agree with you and this needs to be done actually because the problem right now is that we always see a woman supporting another woman but a man very rarely supports no, another no. man whenever a man tries to share his i will tell you one thing uh, those who are feminist uh, they are not so dangerous for us because feminists they are working for women fine no problem but the male feminist those who are the male feminists they are much more dangerous for everybody for us at least because they are doing very very wrong things and they are not uh, the right choice for feminists also. is male feminist are very very bad for the male feminist because uh, usually men are uh, not uh, like women kaise aap bata rahe hai na ke jaise women whenever one woman is telling something every woman is supporting her yes ha aisa hua hai so but not men will not do that first of all men have to do that ya ha aisa bhi hota hai उनके साथ ऐसा ही हुआ है पहले वो मेन ही बताने लगेंगे देखिए जाके ये बहुत खराब आदमी है ये ठीक आदमी नहीं है बट यू हैव टू डू दैट फर्स्ट यू हैव टू सपोर्ट मेन देन ओनली इट विल ग्रो एंड इट विल गो अहेड अदरवाइज नॉट यस डेफिनेटली बिकॉज़ इफ मेन डजंट सपोर्ट मेन देन हाउ कैन वी एक्सपेक्ट अदर्स टू सपोर्ट मेन हाउ कैन वी एक्सपेक्ट रूल्स टू कम इन सपोर्ट ऑफ मेन or laws to come in support yes. of men so that is the thing that yeah, men yeah. needs to understand that when a, uh, if a boy is crying then they should not make fun of that if a man says that yes. i am being uh, tortured by my wife then that should not be made fun ki tu to maar khata bhi bhi say this should not be done and this happens we, actually we don't think about boys we don't at all think about boys we don't think if they are all they can be sexually abused we don't think they can be also going to school and everywhere 
we are in poxo also even we also only think a girl child can be abused in trafficking we never think that boys are also get traffic agreed we only think about um, girls are doing everything and for boys there is nothing for boys kuch bhi nahi hota but there are many issues that's a different issue we can talk about that another day that's a very very big issue बट यहाँ पे ना हमारे जो बच्चे लोग होते हैं मतलब लड़का जो होता है उनके जो परवरिश जिसे बोलते हैं ना वही बहुत गलत तरीके से होता जाते हैं बहुत गलत तरीके से तो अरे बॉय यू हैव टू डू दिस यू हैव टू डू दैट यू हैव टू डू दिस मतलब उनको ना पहले से ना वैसे हम लोग तैयार करते हैं कि यू हैव टू डू ऑल दिस रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी और हमारे जो लड़की लोग अभी है ना उन लोगों को हम सिर्फ राइट्स के बारे में बताए बट वी हैव नॉट टॉट देम अवर ड्यूटी वॉट इज देयर ड्यूटी लड़के के पास सिर्फ ड्यूटी है और लड़कियों के पास सिर्फ राइट्स है तो देर इज नो बैलेंस डेफिनेटली ट्रू यस एंड मैम लास्टली आई वुड लाइक लाइक टू यू नो आस्क यू दैट व्हाट मैसेज यू थिंक दैट यू हैव टू गिव टू आवर फॉलोअर्स इफ यू हैव एनी मैसेज टू गिव टू ऑल आवर फॉलोअर्स हु आर वाचिंग यू राइट नाउ जो मैसेज है वो तो पहले आपने ही बता दिया प्लीज सपोर्ट मैन दोर मैन प्लीज सपोर्ट मैन एंड वी आर आस्किंग फॉर अ जेंडर न्यूट्रल सोसाइटी डेफिनेटलीक्वालिटी फॉर एवरीबडी इक्वालिटी डजेंट मीन दे वुमेन आर नॉट इक्वल सो वी वॉन्ट एंड एवरी टाइम वेन यू आर कॉइंग टॉकिंग अबाउट जेंडर इक्वालिटी वी थिंक वुमेन आर नॉट इक्वल सो वी नीड जेंडर इक्वालिटी नो वुमेन आर ऑल्सो नॉट इक्वल सो जेंडर इक्वेलिटी फॉर ऑल अगर वुमेन के पास 49 नाइन लॉज है देन एटलीस्ट मेन तो एटलीस्ट नाइन लॉज तो लाइन नाइन लॉज तो डिवाइड उनको तो डिजर्व करते हैं ना तो दैट्स कॉल इक्वेलिटी ठीक है फोर्टी नाइन में से नाइन लॉज अगर मेन के लिए होगा तो दैट्स वी कॉल दैट्स इक्वेलिटी हमें फोर्टी नाइन नहीं चाहिए वी डोंट वॉन्ट फोर्टी नाइन बट वी हमारे वॉन्ट कि एटलीस्ट नाइन तो होना चाहिए ना अदरवाइज वेरी इक्वेल society definitely and men should support men and there there should be a good society not like this and women empowerment doesn't mean my body my choice if it means like that then men can also can tell my body my choice yes definitely so uh, thank you so much mrs bhattacharya for joining us and uh, we look forward to more such discussions with you and i'm hopeful that you know uh, your words have definitely motivated all our followers and uh, those men who are suffering in silence who definitely try to come out and share their stories with the world so that we can you know uh, try to spread more awareness about such issues yeah. thank you so If much you, want, you can also share. yeah you can also share our helpline numbers and everything yes definitely ma'am so thank, thank you so you much once again and we hope to see you soon thank you sure